Stuff connected. Oh, somebody's got a message. I'm fixing to find out um, some signs and some uh, messages. Thank you, Archangel Michael, for coming down. Garden of Technus is the channel of messages. Um, thank you, Ascending Masters and um, Ancestors, for everything you do. All your helpful healing messages and the truth. Okay? Um, somebody's got a message. Let me, let me hear the energy with my bell. Look at here, y'all. Oh, this teeny little safety pin. Somebody, somebody looking for some safety. Just a little tiny bit of safety. Okay. Okay. What's the message? Who's it for? Give me the signs. Of who is it for? That's too many. Give me the signs. Of who it's for? Who's this message for? Who's the message for? So someone's been enlightened. Okay, someone sees the sun. Um, it could be indicating something to do with a Leo, but this is a fire sign. Okay, that's a Leo, um, Aries, and uh, Sagittarius. Okay, uh, someone's seeing the sun. The sun is um, is Leo's uh, planet. Okay, so let's see what, what's, this went to the floor. Mars. Okay, that's an air sign planet. Or water sign planet. Venus. Something to do with love and war. This is love and war right here. We got 13 and 23, a 17 and a 16. For a fire sign. Some kind of, or something very passionate. Somebody very passionate about something. Secret. Or very somebody's intuitive about it. It's something to do with a Taurus, y'all. Okay, we got a 14 and a 2. <clears throat> All right, we got the sun and the moon. Um, some A secret is being exposed about some kind of passionate uh, love and war situation. Like um, male and female situation, okay? And it's something to do with a Taurus or somebody that's very, very stubborn. Okay, and a Virgo. A two and a six. All right, what else? Someone very beautiful. And a Gemini. We got a Taurus, a Virgo, and a Gemini out here, y'all. With love and war, a uh, secret being exposed so, about some kind of passion. Somebody's really passionate or lit a fire under their butt. And a Scorpio. Okay, destiny. Scorpio is an eight. So the sun, the moon, and destiny. Scorpio. It's something to do with Scorpio. Um, planet Jupiter is uh, the, the planet of luck. Okay. And um, there's a lot of air and water out here um, on the other signs. And then you have these two um, earth signs right here. Okay. Someone's passionate about, uh, this is a, like a twin flame. This is male and female. Mars and Venus is male and female, okay? Then you got the, the sun, which is the center, the center of attention, um, like, like the star everybody sees, um, the light shines on them. And then you have someone that's very, very intuitive about a situation, okay? And it's a Scorpio. Scorpios are very intuitive. Um, they're a water sign, okay? Um, this is something about a twin flame situation or a twin situation. Okay, like a collaboration. Someone transformed. The fire has transformed them. Okay. Um, they were very stubborn about thinking they knew something they didn't really know. They were very stubborn about it, okay. And then they saw the light. See how that's all glowing behind her back? Okay, it could have to do with a Taurus, a Virgo, a Gemini, or a Scorpio, okay? Um, but some, luck is about to change for someone. Luck is coming in. Because planet Jupiter's the biggest planet, and it's to do with luck, okay? It says someone was all tied up, holding on to something that was blocked from them. They saw the light. They saw the sun. Okay. What else? 
It says it caused a lot of drama and fighting. Okay, and mirroring as well. Okay. About over a cup of love. That goes right there. Okay. And a wish. Someone made a wish. Very stubborn about it, too. Matter of fact, like, about it. That's too many. But the Queen of Pentacles there, anyway. It says, and someone went through struggles because of this wish. Someone was all in their head, covering up something, walking in the snow barefoot. One of them's got on a sock and a boot, but walking with a cane. Okay. This went to the floor. Um, there's, it's over. Um, it's being exposed through this moon. Okay. The moon is exposing something in the world. Um, naked. Exposing it naked. Okay. Look, bringing it to the light. Okay. Bringing it out into the public. About some kind of love. Alright. And and how this person was back here doing things. When this person was trying, you know, thought that they was getting a gift or receiving a cup. Okay. It says, and someone's taking action on a wish. Like, they made a wish, they see it, and now they start, are taking action. They've climbed three mountains and got enlightened. Okay. It says something was something being put to a death or someone or a rebirth um, a whole new beginning for this Queen of Cups. Which that looks like the Queen of Cups with her head turned away from all of it. You see, it looks like her. So she's she's turned her head away from it. Okay. Like stepped away from it. The chariot. Something either coming in really quick or it's talking about a cancer now or polarity. Um, it's coming in to balance everything out and keep it going. <sighs> Come on, keep going and heal. This person's a healer too. It's got angel wings with a cross on the front of it on the shield. Okay, the Queen of Cups is. It says something about, something about this lover's situation is coming in quickly. So this person is somebody you know, action's being taken. You know it's destiny, because that's on the eight, the Scorpio. Okay. That's too many. All right. All right. Something's being exposed. You see how them flipped over? That's something's being exposed. Coming to the community about it. Um, rising above. This is too many. I'm, I'm taking that many. Okay. Say it better than that. It says stability for this empress is coming in. Because she rose above all that community shit. Okay? It got exposed. Alright. It says this is a runner chaser sh situation. Okay? And somebody's holding on like crazy and struggling about it. Okay? It's a runner chaser situation. King of Pentacles. It was the Knight of Pentacles and blocked. Got blocked. Or block somebody like a fool. The devil. <laughs> Every time, y'all. The king of pentacles and that devil. They're the same person. <laughs> king of pentacles represents a Capricorn. Okay? And all about earth and earthly things. It also has a Taurus on here, which is all about earth and earthly things. There's fools on there. They're very stubborn, okay? Um, thinking they know everything, um, but they, they, they're very intelligent about earth and very skilled about earthly things, but when it comes to spiritual things, um, they tend to neglect it, okay, unless it's on the darker side of stuff. Um, what will it bring to them on this earthly realm, okay? Uh, this is representing a Capricorn, I'm saying, or an earth sign. Uh, um, but this person seems obsessed, like a fool. But they're coming forward to tell something to bring it out into the public. Okay, they're bringing it where the public can see. They're taking action towards that. It says the Wheel of Fortune for them. The Wheel of Fortune is coming. Somebody working hard at breaking down the illusions. Okay, this was a magician. 
All these things were covered up and they were showing, but one more thing needs to be exposed. Okay? Thank you, Spirit. That's what they're telling me. That's what they're saying. It says something was blocked and somebody was blindfolded because of um, something was put in their face. Okay? Something was put in their face to blindfold them from, from their true wish fulfillment. Okay? And, and like money or... Uh, girls or drugs or something was put in their face okay and it blindfolded them okay and this king of swords seen it and was whoa wait a minute now um and wants to come forward now and walk away from all of that okay that's the secret um is that they're bringing forth a secret the king of swords is bringing bringing in a secret quickly with this chariot to the lover to you collective seen the light about something about this queen of wands Using magic on the Emperor. What? There's the Emperor and the Empress right beside each other. This Ace of Pentacles comes right in between them. What? Y'all. Because that's what... Whoa. What the hell? This unexpected money came between this emperor and empress because of this queen of wands and this magician. And this king of swords saw the light. Bringing something between. Strength is coming with that ace of pentacles and justice. Look, y'all see? Look. Got two. There was a cloak. Somebody watching them poison love. Somebody was watching. This king of swords was watching this queen of wands and this magician poison this love between this emperor and this empress. Justice is coming. Okay? I mean, they poisoned the shit out of it. That's the truth about it. They stood there and watched. Okay? It's the star. It's supposed to be the queen of pentacles. The fair lady. The chariot, the chariot and the queen of uh, the cups is up underneath them, okay? Their love was confused, and they said, I'm leaving this. I'm not carrying all these burdens. To hell with that. I'm turning my back on that, and I'm going to look out into the world, okay? Um, I just straightened up all these cards, and this one was up underneath. I put them all face up, okay? And this one's facing down for some reason, and um, I'm not going to be wounded anymore is what they said. This is what the star said, this Queen of Pentacles. I'm just going to go on. Um, this Knight of Wands has a secret that the High Priestess exposed the King of Wands and told about his love, okay? About this, his love to this Queen of, I mean this Empress. He's sitting on the, the Empress. The King of Wands is sitting on the Emperor, okay? Um, the high priest is sitting on the magician, and the secret is sitting on the queen of wands. <laughs> Just saying, okay? Um, something was juggled, okay? Judgment and temperance is here together. The angels saw it all. They saw everything, y'all. I mean, these angels are watching all of this, and they're covering up on top of the... They're laying on top of the queen of wands, exposing it to the hermit. The King of Swords has been watching everything and been watching this fair lady. He's underneath the King of Pentacles. Herman is under the devil. Somebody, somebody tried to run off with your love, okay? And the Queen of Swords said, hold up, Joker. You can forget about that shit. This shit's supposed to be made fair. And this has something to do with a Libra. I felt it when I just had to... It's something to do with a Libra. A Libra helped to take from you and give to them. To their self. And that's about to be made fair. Okay, it's causing a tower. People are standing on the edge. They're all like, holy shit, somebody's fixing to expose all of this. There's all kinds of messages. They're, they're kind of far off, but they're there. You see all them birds? Okay, about somebody doing something with someone's destiny, their money, and hiding it in a tree, in a bush, okay? Hiding in a bush and watching it. Nobody's touching it as far as I can see, okay? And, um, 
Well, that's enough right there. What else about this hiding it in a bush? Okay, the sun. Someone's seen the sun about it. This is on a gray horse, y'all. There's four sunflowers. Growth. A baby sitting on a naked baby sitting on a on a gray horse. Facing the King of Cups. Alright. Wish fulfillment. Someone saw the sun. The, <clears throat> the King of Cups is in love with the Empress. That's the truth. I can't make it up. He wants to offer you his love. Alright. What else? Past life connection. Knight of Swords. Coming in quickly. The, you both are spiritual leaders. Y'all have a mission. You have keys. You've been given a key too. Um, I, I've been given a key. I, I, I can see it. I've been given a key, a sword, and a cloak. So someone's heart is broken over this past life connection because of, of the betrayal. There was betrayal in the past life that they can't forgive and they keep coming back and hurting you and they want it to be healed, okay? Because um, it's something you didn't see or something they didn't see. Divine was showing it to them and they didn't see it because of like karmic karmic situation you understand like um drugs or or, or something was keeping them from seeing um to, so they could heal this past life connection he said something there's no peace like home okay um you guys are home together and when you're together you're healed okay when you're apart you don't feel completely healed it says what speak up what <laughs> it says use your art Warrior of light. Something was poisoned. Your love was poisoned. I sibling. Give it to God and let it go. You guys are twins. Both of you smell the roses. And you know something. You know something for sure that you were poisoned. Okay. Warrior light. Something about a rainy day and besties. Who the hell are besties? Self-hate. Past life. <laughs> You're besties in a past life. And, wow, something came to me like you. Almost like a Romeo and Juliet situation where you guys killed yourselves or something. And one of you didn't die. And the other one's mad about it. I don't know. I don't know where that came from, y'all. It says dance. It's telling the water sign to dance. The Cancer, or Scorpio, or Pisces. Dance. Okay. Home. Get enlightened. And I have victory. Okay. There's some kind of secret life. He says, I love you. He says, I love you right there. Healed. I love you too. It says right now. <laughs> it says here's the sword of truth right on, right on top look and I see the truth right there okay it says yin because this was trying to slide out yin needs what's the secret life dreams yin needs dreams okay you know something about walking away Okay. Smell the roses. Live your life. Enjoy things. And people get mad. So what? That's the truth. It says someone's crying out. The twins. Get on with it. Smile. <laughs> Broken skit roses struggles. Okay. It says choose to sleep uninterested by choice. Whoa. Okay. Give it to God and let it be. You're an empathic. Okay, you have addictions you need to get rid of. If it's caffeine, if it's drugs, if it, that's drugs. Um, cigarettes, all that. You need to get rid of those uh, addictions. It says, what you think is not possible is possible. Nothing is impossible. Okay. Siblings, ca use caution with. Because there's drugs and stuff involved. Use your, your enlightenment. Okay. Um, someone's coming to you te telepathically and in your dreams. Astro dreams. Um, astro travel. You have inner peace, and it's driving them crazy. It says you're a chosen one. 
and you're getting rewarded for staying on the path. You can look in people's eyes and see their soul. It helps. It helps them. Okay, or they look in your eyes and see your soul and it helps them. It says there's drama coming. Cleanse. Or cleanse from the drama um, that you've already experienced. That's the sort of truth. Okay. Wait. Alright. Just read out of one of these books here. Well, that is crazy. Y'all, all that resonates with me. What? Oh, let's read out of Skunk and the Badger. <laughs> I like this book, y'all. It's silly. What y'all got to say, Skunk and Badger? Page 116. It says, all these big letters, look at that. It says, also, you... It says, also, you defended our guest. I did nothing. I did not even listen to you. I am sorry for that, too, and I have not welcomed you into the brownstone, which you have as much right to, to the brownstone as I do. Badger swallowed. What he yelled next was something I decided he had. Please, Lord, let me just speak. They're trying to stop me from speaking clearly. Okay. It says, what he had... Held, what he had yelled next. Okay, hack the breath. Okay, I feel better. Okay. What he had yelled next was something that he decided as, as he lay flat on this boulder. The brownstone is yours. I'm moving out. What? Amen. That's what I've done. Badger swallow. Okay. It says, um, Skunk's head jerked back with a, with a shake. Skunk walked closer. Would you say that again, please? But in a quieter voice, I'm letting you have the brownstone. I'm moving out. Skunk marched right up to Badger's snout. But the brownstone is your home. And now it's yours, said Badger, nodding. He felt lighter. Har har. Skunk shook his head. Um, this is not funny, Badger. You own too many rocks. You can't carry all of them in a suitcase. Simply, simplicity is good, said Badger. I will cut it, cut it down. <laughs> That's what I, okay, it says Skunk held up a paw to think. Finally, with hesitation, he nodded. Simplicity has its advantages, yes. It is nice when everything fits in a red suitcase. But it is nicer to have a moon room and a good kitchen. Believe me, being without a home is not good. Amen to that. Okay. So he's telling them to think before you leap. Um, you know, um, to be without a home or whatever. Um, see, let me let me tell you a little little scenario. Okay. So, um, met counterpart and I when we first first met. He kept trying to talk to me even after he said he couldn't. Okay. And he kept trying to talk to me, get weed or whatever, okay? And um, and he said to me, he said, I can't do anything. Um, I won't have a place to live. Now, we just met. And I was like, oh, that's bullshit. I said, you know, you can figure out something, okay? And he was like, um, that was like what his excuse was. He couldn't leave there because he wouldn't have no place to go. Um, because me and him had just met, and he was, like, scary about coming where I was because it was right beside the place where they all work at. And I was like, I ain't scared. I don't give a fuck. <laughs> I was like, you can come over here, and we'll figure it out from there, okay? Um, if that's the case. Um, but that's what he said, you know. Um, but he was like, um, that I wanted to talk to me more, but he said something. So, building blocks are falling down, y'all. Okay, but yeah, that was that was weird that it resonated with me. If it resonated with you, hit that like button, subscribe, hit that little bell notification, okay? What does it say? For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son, that whosoever shall believeth in him should not perish but have everlasting life. John three sixteen. Okay, what do y'all got to say? I know y'all got some shit to say. Let's see. What do y'all got to say? This is from Divine Masculine. Okay, wait, y'all.
divine masculine says you cute you queen it says q qua qua qualit qualit money is growing nine nine seven nine nine seven six nine seven six six seven six seven six six nine six nine six nine seven nine okay it's two nines two sixes this is a cancer 1970 cancer i'm telling you this is for cancer 1970 quality it's quality even i mean quality might even be a word so let me check y'all probably in the urban dictionary okay <laughs> Q-U-A-L-E-T. You mean Quizlet? Quizlet is a clothing shoe and jewelry on Amazon. Quizlet means tap. Clothing. Amazon. 25 to 25.99. Dark gray. Got Quizlet men's tap. Quizlet. Envirotalk Services Incorporated is the blog creator of Quizlet. The blog is written by environmental professionals for environmental professionals. Forum, okay. Uh, quality Early Childhood Education Institution. If somebody here's name name is Quality. Quality spices. <laughs> well, there you go, y'all. Dang, that sounded like the Duke. That sounded like the Duke. Y'all been watching a lot of stuff. I don't know if y'all keep up. Uh, look, I don't watch news and shit. I be like just intuition will send me to somewhere and I'll be like watching shit, okay? Um, like all this shit that's going on in the world that's showing like signs of revelation, like the apocalypse and shit. I mean, that shit's crazy, but it's happening. I mean, you can't not, you can see it. Somebody wants tea time. It says someone likes to color teal. It says someone wants to squeal without the tea wheel, tea school, tea school. <laughs> Ale, somebody's drinking. Quail. Quat. Q-A-T. Lou, Yule, something might be happening around December, okay? Okay, it says somebody's a tool. Okay, somebody tells tales, um, like, tall tales, like, it's the truth, but it's a tall tale at the same time, okay? Um, it says someone's late. Someone's late. So, 96. July. July 9th, September. Okay, take it how you, how you feel, okay? It says, quote. Someone is quoting you. I said that before, y'all. Somebody is quoting you. They're quoting th something that you said, or they're saying that you said it. Okay? Um, I'm not sure if you said it or not. They're saying that you did, though. Okay, it says, eat. It says, toe. Okay, a toe. Qua. Qua. Toe. A lot. Someone told a lot. That's what they're trying to say. Someone told a lot. They said told a lot. E.T. Hmm. Toe. Al. Someone told Al. Whoever Al is. Who cares? This is. Quail. Quail. Queen. Uh, Queet. <laughs> no. <laughs> At 
Q O at L. L means God. Someone's laughing at L. At God. Tele tele quote. I don't know. But there's the letters. Someone's late though. Someone's telling tales. Equals and divide. Divided we fall. We're equal now. This. Divided we fall. A O E. A O L. <coughs> A O L. E T. E T. U T. U T. Quit is a word. Q U E T. Let's see what it means. What is Q U E T? According to Wardlow, now the proposed unit of consuming power designed to reduce to a common basis the consuming power of families which differ in sex and age composition. It says it is a proposed unit of consuming power designed to reduce to a common basis the consuming power of families which differ in sex and age compositions. Wow. The most Giller Gillermot. The common Gillermot. Whatever that is. Okay, a quit in Urban Dictionary. When a woman receives flowers the day after performing oral sex. Did you see the girl's desk today? She earned a huge bio quit. Bo quit. Okay, bouquet. <laughs> Last night. Oh my god. That's <laughs> It says, um, mortuaries, um, are great places. Calm and quit once you get past the odd smell. <laughs> okay, I said that for a reason. It says something about a mortuary. Whatever. It says equal. Somebody is equal. And equal is on here, y'all. Somebody feels like you're equals. Like nine nine six six connected equal to seven equal to I'm telling you it says they're equal okay stop collaborate and listen I is back with a brand new invention something because all of me tightly okay Let's see what somebody's most likely to do. Look at all these. Alright. Whoa. <laughs> I'm just going to pick a couple. Would, would trash talk at the Special Olympics. Go missing within 15 minutes of going out. Would survive in woods with just a hatchet. It's total lightweight. Changes a song every 30 seconds. <laughs> okay, has a dark side. Has three-hour conversations about space. Has sex while watching TV. Gets popcorn buckets from the trash for refills. <laughs> Is actively preparing for the end of the world. <laughs> okay, well, I just thought I'd throw them out there. This is right here funny. It says, thinks reality is TV. Reality TV is real. <laughs> okay, ain't nothing on TV real. Nothing. I don't care if it's the news. I don't give a crap what it is. Ain't nothing on TV real. Nothing. What's the burning question? If you could have any animal in the world as a pet, what it, would it be and why? Okay. All right. Was well, any of this resonates with y'all? Like and, like and subscribe, okay? If you want to donate to the channel, it's um, all down in the descriptions. It says abundance. You have abundance coming. Congratulations. It seems you're due for a little piece of abundance pie. Feel like you don't deserve it? Knock it off. It's already plated and ready to hit your table. Reluctant to take it? Shut your hole. Abundance pie is big enough to serve everyone. So get your whipped cream ready unless you're lactose intolerant and enjoy your well-deserved metaphorical dessert. All three of these are bonus cards, y'all. It says manifestation. If you could have anything you wanted, what would it be? Get specific and get greedy. You are holding magic wand and you can conjure up anything. Could it be that when you declare your wishes out loud, you're actually casting a spell for your dreams to come true? 
or is it that just in very practical sense the more people you speak with about your desires the more folks there are who know who what you want and might have the means to help you make them happen either way stop waiting and start manifesting but don't use that word if you don't want to okay manifestation get grounded heart and creative i told you these three keep coming out so you need to get grounded use your heart open your heart space and get creative dance sing uh color whatever the hell it is you like to do go out there and look at insects it says strength you are hereby declared a strong resilient warrior of heroic proportions enjoy your battles whatever they are because you're guaranteed to come through them stronger brighter and more compassionate and based on what i know of mythology probably with a great hair and a six pack hallelujah okay all right well like love to everybody i hope y'all enjoyed this reading um i enjoyed it i think it's a really good reading um somebody feels like you're an equal um to them um that y'all share the energy equally right now um the frequency and vibration is like on point and somebody's about to come towards you it says you have everything you need right now open your heart okay past life possibilities Raise your standards, elevate your expectations. You have unlimited potential. Okay? Don't forget who you are now. It says go to the sea and remember who you are, okay? With your experiences. Um, let go of all that shit you don't need to hold on to anymore. Okay? There's a tower coming because of holding on to shit, okay? It says the will of fortune. Can make that tower change shit, okay? Let me go on down here. It says use your gut, use your gut instinct. And the universe wants you to know obstacles are detours in the right direction. Okay? So if you're feeling like you did, like you made the wrong choices or whatever, um, just give it a little bit of divine timing, okay? This is, this, the truth is here for this Father of Cups. He's bringing in the truth. Okay? Those fell like that, so I grabbed them. It says, don't let your past hold you back. A personal is issue reaches resolution for a cancer. Okay? Light love to you. I love y'all. Namaste. I hope y'all have a wonderful, wonderful uh, Memorial Day. I'll be back. I'll probably be back tonight. And um, I'm going to somehow or another, I might do um, the monthly reading for the each um, elements, okay? Because um, I don't do them all because it takes forever to do 12 um, readings for the for the horoscopes. Um, it takes forever for it to download, and I don't, I don't, it just won't do it. My phone, this phone jacked up, boy, I don't care for it. But anyway, it, it's working right now. Anyways, thank God. Okay. All right, what, what do you need to know? Oh, one of these? Okay. Think with your whole body. Nobody has a better vision of who you are than yourself. On that, on that note, namaste. See you on the flip side.